It's, uh, it's a thing that it's, it's almost, un you can't sort of, you kind of put it into words, it's a, it's a feeling, it's a, it's a sort of a breath in the air that, that swans around. Some of the first songs that I ever heard that, that came from the, the, uh, the Mayan villages, uh, they, they came from the pen of Tommy Armstrong, who's you know, widely regarded as the Pittman's poet, uh, simply because I was born and bred in, in that neck of the woods and they were still being sung around a bit. A lot of the songs that were being sung when I was a kid weren't so much the coal mining songs that he wrote, but the songs of, uh, of what went on in the villages, the, the, the community songs, the things like War Nanny's Amaze that you couldn't escape from. I mean, every, every Friday night in just about every pub in the, the, where there was a sing song, it, it got done. Uh, but the, the thing that always got me was the, uh, the first song he ever wrote uh, at the age of 15 when he was still, uh, still a, a boy in Shotley Bridge and uh, he'd, he'd managed to avoid education which probably meant he had a better education than most of the kids that went. Uh, but they, he, he'd, uh, he escaped more times than enough and, and spent most of his time uh, learning from the folk around him. And for the, uh, the subject of his first song he chose the day of his own birth I think that's quite weird, <laughs> but very admirable. So you can get in where you go. I'll deem me best to please you, and the best can deem ain't me. I'm going to sing about myself when I was born and where. Where I was born at Shotley, and I've heard me mother say it was in the month of August and upon the 15th day. You see, I remember that morning I was born as if it was the neat. The pits were all idle the next day because it was Sunday, but you wonder thought it was Sunday in Warhouse. There was that much tea and ginger beer drunken, I was forced to stop the tap. Dolly Potts got tight and she flung a saucer at Betty Green but it missed her and catched me right between the eyes and the mouth and I've had a great look there ever since. But we soon made her an outside passenger and enjoyed ourselves with singing. He's the best of honey, his yes it is a bonny, who will call him Tommy, he's the picture of his da. So they popped on the kettle as soon as things were settled, then the tea was fettled on the ball of the lad. I mind it was warm weather when they received this lad. Me father danced upon the floor to show that he was glad. The doctor had just landed and she called us for me name. I says, God bless thee little heart, I was pleased to his landed yem. You see, they expected me three months before that. I'm a 12 month bear. <laughs> you can see that with me size. That was the first time I set eyes on Betty Lee, the midwife. She picked us up, laid us across her knee and said to me, mother, I think I'll wish him. I thought she said, I think I'll thresh him. I'll chop her up round. If she had laid one finger on me, I'd have gone straight back where I come from. But never mind. We've got a new suit of clears on a good wish and enjoyed ourselves with singing. He's the best of honey. He's yes, it is a bonny. Who will call him Tommy? He's the picture of his da. So they popped on the kettle as soon as things were settled. Then the tea was fettled. Now the world of the land. The neighbours come to breakfast, the newborn bear to see. Mistress White got mortal drunk with drinking Stuart's tea. Miss Watson was religious, and so was Mistress Kay. And as soon as John were breakfast, why they both knelt down to pray to you now. The breakfast was hardly over till they're doing under their knees and started to pray at the tops of their voices. Well, when they started praying, I started to sing Johnny Comes Marching Home. It was a big favourite of mine at the time. Nan watching suits the Betty Lee. Will you stop that child from crying or I must cease praying? Betty says, the Ben's not crying. He's singing, so they are going to get onto their feet and join in the chorus as well. He's the best of honey, it's yes it is a bunny, who will call him Tommy, he's the picture of his da. They popped on the kettle as soon as things were settled, then the tea was fettled on the mouth of the lad. My ward says Mistress Robson as she laid us on her arm, in all my life I've never met with such a whitey man. The doctor had just landed, so I seized him by the coat, and a little were they thinking that the bear he was a poet. 
Soon as ever the doctor come within the door, I grabbed him by the neck, and I didn't forget to shake him either. I was a very big lad when I was very little. I asked him how he'd like to stop inside three months after his time was up, but we soon got out reach. My father whistled, Becky and the doctor danced still close in time, and I was there were laughing. So we finished with singing, He's the best of honey, his fierce and his a bunny. Oh, well, come to me, he's the picture of his da. So they popped on the kettle as soon as things were settled. Then the tea was petaled, all aboard.